Hey guys, we're back here on the Hunter Call of the Wild and today we are back in Revon Tule Coast and I am very excited. Today we're going to be doing some waterfowl hunting. I'm actually going to use a ground blind and see if that works better than the water blind. So I actually have two setups here. I have one for Eurasian Widgeon and I have one on the other side for Eurasian Teal. And where I am is bottom right hand corner of the map and this area guys is amazing for all kinds of different species of geese and ducks. There are lots of them. Now both Eurasian Teal and Eurasian Widgeon have a collar. I'm gonna load them onto my new weapon wheel. All right. So guys, how are you liking the new weapon wheel? Let me know in the comments. Are you using it a lot? I haven't even put out a call and I already have ducks coming in. Isn't that sweet? So if you have had a chance to hunt ducks since the update, they definitely are a lot more challenging, but they're also a lot more fun. They fly way faster than they used to. And that has affected not just Revontuli, but every map in Call of the Wild. So, so basically you want to just be patient, wait for them to land. Hopefully they will all land in a pretty condensed area and then you can start shooting with that shotgun. Now, if you do enjoy today's video, guys, go ahead and smash that like button. You guys are awesome and we're gonna head straight into it. And here they come. I love how they land now, it's so awesome. All right, we do have a level two there. We do have one male. They're so beautiful. All right, there they are. And here we go. They're not easy to get once they've started flying. Definitely not. But we did get quite a few there. We did all right. So the one thing I prefer about using a blind on the land is that I can actually look straight up. When you're in the waterfowl blind, you can't actually look straight up. It's a little bit constricting. All right. Just a female brown, but aren't they beautiful? They've done such an amazing job on the ducks. And that is absolutely gorgeous. So that's a dark green Eurasian teal 352. Oh my goodness, this guy is two points under diamond. I can't believe it. Holy, that's about as close as you can come without being a diamond. Well, hopefully he comes back bigger and isn't that gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful and another really nice one. So they don't pay too well, $370 for a duck. So they're not gonna make you rich. So duck hunting is definitely way more fun and it is definitely way more challenging. Guys, let me know in the comments, do you like it better since the update or did you prefer it better before? I found it really boring before. They just sat there. This is awesome. What I love about this new map is it's perfect for running and gunning, which really is a lot of fun to do. You can just simply run through any area and something is gonna fly overhead and you can just pull out that shotgun and start firing away. All right, so let's call some widgeon in. Sounds pretty cool. And what do we have coming? We have teal. <laughs> 350, we do have some males and what are those? And we have widgeon right over there. So you can actually mix your decoys guys and you will get a variety of ducks coming in or geese or both. And we have one that goes up to 357. It'd be nice if he would land. So right now we're being bombarded by two species of ducks. All females so far. Let's have some males, shall we? There's one. And there's another one and that is my big boy. That's the one I want. That's the one I want. All right, here we go. Not easy. And once they start flying, it gets to be very difficult to get them, but I am gonna try anyway. Do we have any males here? No, I'm not even gonna bother to be honest. Let's go grab these guys. So you definitely do want to be in some sort of blind when you are shooting ducks. That is just a female. So because the hunting pressure will definitely affect it. I have quite a lot of hunting pressure there. There's a level two female. Another female, I think this is our male. 349 and 354 is a diamond. So we're getting very close without actually making it to diamond. So we're gonna have to get lucky one of these times. So definitely set up in this area here. I have another setup over here for tufted duck. There's Eurasian widgeon, there's Eurasian teal. I have seen mallards here. I have seen bean geese. So this area is absolutely fantastic for waterfowl hunting. And also this is another amazing spot. Let's go see if we can find some gray leg geese. 
Okay, guys, so now we're gonna do a little bit of hunting for gray lag geese. Now, interestingly, all of the goose callers sound the same, but they don't work the same. So it is important that you use the correct caller. So, and I'll show you where we are set up. So I'm in the bottom right-hand corner. This lake right here is really great for gray leg geese. But sometimes it does take them quite a while to land. I think I do like the ground blinds better because I can look straight up. Now, I haven't been lucky enough to find a five yet. Come and land for me, baby. You can do it. Now, if you are doing waterfowl hunting with your dog, guys, get them to sit. It might be a good idea to put your dog away, which I always forget to do. Are you coming in? Tufted duck, so you definitely can set up in this area for tufted duck as well. Basically, whatever you see flying overhead, that means you can set up for whatever that is in that area, because they are going to be there. So that makes it easy to figure out where to put your setups. Okay, guys, we have a level four coming in. So that is a diamond potential goose. So I'm going to keep my eyes on him. Hope that he lands fairly close by. Come on, big boy, you can do it. Oh, he's attentive. Here we go. He dead! Didn't get the second one. That's all right. We got the big guy. Don't they look amazing? They are gorgeous. And that is the 3.5 and 3.85 is diamond. So not big enough. It's not easy to find a level four diamond, but it definitely is possible. So that's a great spot for gray leg geese. Bottom right hand corner. Okay, so maybe if I can get my big boy to land, I can just take him out with the 22. He's not here. All right, let's see, how far are they? They're over there at my setup here. <laughs> this is my new way to get my big boy. Get him to land from the side. All right, well, they're, they're 200 meters away and I can only zero to 150, so I'm gonna try. Each dot's 50 meters, right? I got it! Okay, they're not, they're not panicked. There's another one. That's three! Okay. Jeez, they're not spooking at all, eh? I got them all. They're not going to float to me, so we're gonna have to go get them. Let's go get them. Okay, that, ooh, gold female. That's a black, I want a black diamond golden eye. So pretty. Oh, leucistic, yes! We got a leucistic golden eye, taxi rat. <laughs> yes! That is sweet. It's just a level one female, but that looks insane. I am very excited. We got something cool, guys. That is so great. Yes. Ah, uh, that is the new 22 truncated cone bullets. Oh, keep her, Kaylee. Where, where, where are you? Of course, I got a bad wind, but where are you? I want you. I haven't got a diamond one of these yet. I want one. And if it's still here, it will give me a warning call. Oh, I'm gonna run. Whoop, 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 whoop. There it is! Oh, it's a three! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh my gosh. I didn't get it. I gotta go after it. I can't believe it's a three! What? What? I'm gonna f I'm gonna track that all day if I have to! <laughs> What is happening? Oh no, that's not them. Is that it? Is it? I must have got it. I must have got it. I didn't think I did. It's dead. <laughs> well, that is pretty sweet. Hello, I just said I, I want a diamond keeper, Kaylee, and there it is. <laughs> We got it! We got a couple shots at 46 meters. Very, very sweet. Now that is a sweet way to start a stream. That was pretty funny. <laughs> Big male, 4.6. Okay, should this not be a diamond? It says it's 4.6 and diamond is 4.64. 
I'm very confused. Well, it says diamond, I'm gonna take it. <laughs> Thank you for the nice shot. Thank you guys, that is pretty nuts, isn't it? That is pretty nuts, that's pretty sweet. And that is where we found it. Talk about random blind luck. That is pretty sweet. Question is, will we find him again? Yeet. That's not him. Oh, that is him! Oh, that's him! Oh my goodness! No! Okay, 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 okay. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I'm gonna cry. I thought that was a different kind of bird! That was him! <laughs> he looked off white! I thought it was- I thought it was a termigan! I thought it was a- Is he coming back? He is. That's him. Oh my goodness, this is terrible! I can't hit him to save my life, I'm gonna keep going after him. He must be leucistic or something. Oh, I got him! I got him! <laughs> I got him! I got him! I didn't think I did, but I did! Oh, I hope I didn't shoot him too many times, I don't think so. Oh, look at that! That is insane! That's a Keeper Cali! Look at that thing! Alright, here it is! That really wasn't too hard! It's Leucistic! That is- we got him twice! That is beautiful! He is Leucistic! He's a nice one! And a gold! Wow! Yeah, I, I saw it and I thought it was a different bird altogether because it looks so different from a normal Caper Cali. Holy, what a sweet find! And this is where we found him, right here. <laughs> Again. So there it is, guys. Diamond Western Caper Cali, literally right after I said we need to find a diamond Caper Cali, and there it was. <laughs> there is power in words, I swear there is. And a leucistic as well, and this is an even sweeter trophy. I am so excited to get this. I can't put my leucistic golden eye in the lodge because sadly I did get it on the beta, but that's okay. We'll have to find another one. But that's gonna wrap it up for this one, guys. I really hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, smash that like button. Thank you so much, guys, and we will definitely see you guys in the next one. We're gonna have to fill up this lodge. Take care, guys. If you guys would like to learn the best spots and times to hunt everything in Revontuli Coast, definitely click on this Revontuli Quick Guide.